go ahead and get our warm up going, and then I'll go over the workout and, uh, and we'll get to sweating. So let's go ahead and go wide with your stance with your toes facing out straight ahead. Interlock your fingers. Yeah, you guys know the drill. Push the palms up to the ceiling. Lift your rib cage out of your torso. Get long. Push the palms up. Press the heels down. Tip it left. We're going to hold this for five, four, three, two, one. And let's go up and over to the right and hold this for five, four, three, two, one. Press it back up and drive your hip forward, squeeze your booty, lean back, four, three, two, one, unlock the hands, hinge at your hip, full forward, come all the way over and just hang here for a second, press the knees back, nice straight legs, four, three, two, one, walk both hands over to your left foot, shin, just make sure the legs stay straight, hold this for four, three, two, one, let's walk it over to the other side, and hold this, four, three, two, one. Good, bring both hands right back down the middle. Again, bend the left leg, keep the right leg straight. Drop that hip down. Make sure that the left heel stays on the floor. All right, and you can take your elbow, wedge it inside that left leg and push the knee out. Good, stay low with the hips, walk it over to the other side. Good, four, three, two, one. And switch sides again. Good. Switch it again. Good. And then straighten both legs as you drop your head. And then you're going to walk your feet into hip distance. Give me a deep squat. Just have a seat. Hips down. Chest up. Push your knees out. Yeah. Good. Good. Left hand grabs your right ankle. Reach your right arm up to the ceiling. Let your eye line follow that hand. Two. One, good, let's switch sides. Good, two, one, good, let's switch it again. Two, one, good, then we'll switch that one more time. Reach, 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 good. And then elbows back inside the knees, place your hands on the floor, lean into your elbows, push your knees out. Whew, good. And then rock back to your heels. And then from here, you're gonna straighten your legs as you drop your head. One last stretch on the hamstrings, push the knees back, and slight bend to the knees, curl the spine as you roll up one vertebrae at a time, stretching through each vertebrae. Let's get some shoulder rolls going here, up, back, down, forward. We're gonna go a few times one way, good, and then switch direction for a few, big shoulder rolls there, good. And then hands on your hips, widen your stance, put your chin to your chest and roll your neck around. A few times one way. Good. And switch direction for a few. Good. And look straight ahead. Step your right leg back and let's just swing the right arm. Just like so. Letting gravity do most of the work here. Just whipping that arm around. And switch direction. Good. And then take that swinging arm and bring it across your chest and give it a hug. There you go. Three, two, one, good, shake that out. Step your left leg back, let's swing that left arm. Good, just whipping it around. And switch direction. Good, and then take that left arm, bring it across your chest, give it a hug. Good, let's go wide with the stance again. Hands on your hips, and trunk rotations. So lean back, and then roll the shoulders right, roll them forward, roll them left, roll them back. Right, forward, Left, back, we're going three times, and switch direction. Left, forward, right, and back. Left, forward, and three times, we'll do. All right, and just shake it all out. And let's go right into some bouncing, so some jumping jacks. We're gonna be here for about 20 seconds. Tap the fingers and slap the thighs. Breathing in the nose. Out the mouth. And we're going to change this into seal jacks. Wide arms, wide feet, cross the arms, cross the feet. Good. We're going to take this into X hops. Imagine you're standing in the middle of the M X. Hop your feet out to two ends of the X and back to the middle. Just a little rotation on the hips as you hop in and out. And then we're going to take 
Both feet, we're going to hop to the four corners of this X. Hop to four corners of the X, just in the shape of a box. That's right. Switch direction. Just hop to those four corners. And just quick side to side hops. Just a little polo bounce. Point, point. Good, forward and back. Forward and back. That's right. Twist the hips. Twisty. One more time. Side to side. Good. Forward and back. And twist it. Good. And then pump the knees. A little swing on the arms. Five seconds. Easy pace. Four, three, two, one. And out. Pick it up. Fast as you can. Go five, four. Come on. Three, two, time. All right. So today, we have three circuits that we're going to go to. Each circuit contains three exercises. Each exercise is going to be a 40 second working set, okay? 40 seconds to do as many reps as you can of the exercise you're on. Here's the deal though there are no breaks between the exercises. You go 40 seconds, 40 seconds, 40 seconds. From one exercise to the next to the next, three times. Three exercises, that is. Then, at the end of the three exercises, we take a 30 second break. We're gonna repeat that circuit of three exercises with the rest four times, okay? 40 on, 40 on, 40 on, 30 off. Four rounds. All right, so let's go over what these exercises are real quick. So, one dumbbell, we're gonna do a forward lunge. Uh, this is going to be contralateral, so if you're holding the dumbbell in your right hand, you're going to step forward on your left leg. So you're going to lunge forward, take the dumbbell, drop it to the outside, to the outside of the thigh of that front leg, and turn the shoulders over, right? Push off, bring the dumbbell back. So one thing I want you to think about here, don't keep the shoulders squared up and just reaching your arm, right? I want you to turn the shoulders over so we're getting that twist through the core. Okay, we're gonna go 20 seconds on one leg, 20 seconds on the other leg. Then we're gonna do this little push up with a relocation of the dumbbell. This is what I mean. Dumbbell's gonna be on the floor, okay? You're gonna get into a plank position with the dumbbell overhead. You're gonna do one push up. Grab the dumbbell and put it down, right, with the right arm, push up, grab the dumbbell with the left arm, pick it back up, and then push up, move the dumbbell push up, relocate the dumbbell. So each time you relocate the dumbbell, you grab it with the opposite arm and just move it to another location, okay? Go overhead, go below, side to side, I don't care. Just pick that dumbbell up and move it to a new location. Make sure you're alternating arms each time. That's each, in between each rep of the push up. And then lastly, we're gonna go high knees and we're gonna throw in our one twos. So you're gonna pump the knees and you're gonna go one two. One, two is just a jab cross, or left, right. So you're just punching left, right as the knees pump. When the right leg is elevated, the left arm is extended and vice versa. If you have a jump rope, you can jump rope instead if you would prefer that, okay? So we have our lunges, we have our push-ups, and we have our high knees. 40 seconds each one, 30 second break at the end. I've done so much talking, let's get to moving. Here we go. Get your dumbbells ready, load it up with the right arm. You're gonna lunge forward on the left leg. Twist to the left. In three, two, one. We go, there it is, and then push back. And then twist the shoulders, push back. Rotate the shoulders, push back to the starting position. Get that dumbbell to the outside of that front leg. We're gonna switch at the 20 second mark, and that's coming in three, two, one, switch. Arm, switch, leg. Drop that back knee down and get a little tap on the floor with that back knee and push off that front leg. And again, we're turning the shoulders, not just reaching with the arm. Three, two, one. Time, no break. Put that dumbbell on the floor. Right down to the plank position. Do one push up, grab that dumbbell, move it. Do another push up, grab it with the other hand, Place it in another spot, and then move it. Just relocate that dumbbell each and every time to some other place around the body. Keep it going. 
You got 20 more seconds. Come on. Move that dumbbell. Relocate the dumbbell. Come on. Less than 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two. Come up to standing. Pump those knees. One, two. Now, one, twos. Right here. Get those knees up. Pump the arms. I'm going to say switch. When I do, I want you to go into uppercuts. Switch. Uppercuts. Switch. Back to your one twos. Uppercuts. Switch. Back to one twos. Come on. Back to uppercuts. Switch. Come on. Switch. 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 And three, two, one. That's your first 30 second break. Woo. That's one down. We're going two more rounds here. Two more times. Sorry, my bad. Three, three, woo. Big rest, you got about 15 seconds. Get that dumbbell ready. All right, we're back to our forward lunge and twist. And we go in three, two, one. Step forward, rotate, push back. Rotate, push back, come on. And push it back. Let's go. Push it back. Again, we're turning the shoulders over. Not just reaching with the arm. But get that twist. Switch arms, switch leg. Remember, both knees are about a 90 degree angle. So make sure you're dropping that back knee down. A little tap on the floor with that back knee. If the back knee can't reach the floor, just go as low as you can. Come on, three, two, one. No break, right to those push-ups, let's go. Push-up, relocate that dumbbell. Push-up, move the dumbbell. Push-up, someplace else. Push-up, another location. Push-up in between each movement of that dumbbell. Come on, 20 more seconds. Oh, we're not done yet. Let's keep going. Come on. Ten more seconds. Keep it going. Come on. Five seconds. Four, three, two. Hop up. Get those knees pumping. One, two, one, two. Extend those arms. Come on. Switch uppercuts. Good. Back to your one, two. Switch. Uppercuts. Come on. One, two. Switch. Keep those knees pumping. Switch. Uppercuts. Come on. Switch one, twos. Ten seconds. Let's go. Switch uppercuts. Breathe. And switch it right now. Two, one. That's another 30 second break. Whew. Well done. All right. That was two down, two to go on this first circuit. Ten seconds. We're back to our forward lunge and rotation. All right, get ready. Here we go. Grab the dumbbell, right hand, forward lunge, left leg. One, and let's go. And push back, come on. Hand back. Rotate. Push off that front foot. Twist the shoulders. Come on. Switch arms, switch leg. Push back. Tap that back knee. And you're connecting your breath to this movement. Come on. Five seconds. Let's go. Three, two, dumbbells down. Plank position. Push up, relocate that dumbbell. Let's go. Push up, move it. Push up, relocate. Push up, and there. Always alternating hands. 
Each time you move that dumbbell around. I don't care where you put it. Just reach and move it somewhere. Pick it up and sit down in another place. Come on. Come on. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Pop back up. No rest. Pump those knees. Come on. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Breathe. Switch. Uppercuts. Switch. One, twos. Switch. Uppercuts. Come on. Switch. One, twos. Switch. Uppercuts. Let's go. Switch. One, twos. Keep pumping those knees. Switch it. Come on. Ten seconds. Let's go. Switch. One, twos. Switch. Uppercuts. Two. One. Time, 30 seconds. Woo! Yeah, that's three down. One more to go. Oh, good. Walk it off, breathe it out. Get your mind right, because we got one more round. And that round's gonna start in Three, two, one. Let's go. Lunge and twist and pull back. Push off that front foot. Yeah. 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 Make sounds. It's all good. Come on. Switch leg. Switch arm. Push it back. And. Push it back, come on. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Set that dumbbell down, let's get down to that plank position. Cause we got push ups to work on here. Let's go. Move that dumbbell around. Come on. Just pick it up and put it somewhere else. And a push up in between each one. Yeah, I don't mind knee push ups. Get those knee push ups in. I'll go to my knees for a few. Why not? Come on, less than 10 seconds. Six, five, four. Let's bring it back up. Let's pump those knees. Come on. Come on, pump them. One, two, one, two, one, two. Let's go. Switch, uppercuts. Just little circles in front of the chest. That's all you need to do. One, two, switch. Switch, uppercuts. Come on. Switch, one, two. Keep pumping those knees. Switch, uppercuts. Let's go. Keep it going. Five, four, three, two, Time. Just like that. Just like that. All right. That was one, one down. We got two more, so let me get on with these exercise demonstrations. So next, we are going to do a beast crawl. Beast crawl. Similar to a bear crawl. There's a couple things we want to keep in mind here. So with a beast crawl, you want your hands around the shoulders. You're going to tuck your toes. The knees are going to be just under the hips. And what you're going to do is you're going to take these small steps forward. I know you guys are limited in space. So you can just do these small steps. Okay? Notice a couple things. One, the knee never breaks the plane of the elbow. It never goes past the elbow. So they're really small steps. Two, my knees are close to the ground. Right? And my spine is neutral. And it's also parallel to the ground. So I'm not up here like that. I'm here, okay? So again, 40 seconds there, we're gonna crawl forward and back. Couple paces forward, couple paces back. Then, you're gonna grab your dumbbell. Now we're gonna go into reverse lunges. We're gonna do a reverse lunge, so you're gonna step back. Don't let that back knee touch the floor. As low as you can get it without touching the floor. You're gonna curl, press, and step up, keeping that arm 
locked out overhead, right? So we step back, curl, lock out the elbow, step forward, bring the dumbbell back to the hip, repeat. That's stepping forward, that's challenging. So if you need to modify, step back, do the curl and press from this low position, and just step forward into it, okay? 20 seconds on each leg. Then, you're gonna grab your dumbbell, you're gonna do one squat, just hold the dumbbell in front of your hip, squat, and then squat, jump. Squat, squat, jump. It's that simple. Again, 40 seconds on each one. We'll take a 30 second break after. We're going four rounds. Let's get ready for some beast plank crawls. Here we go, let's get to know the floor a little better. Here we go, three, two, one, and just little easy crawls. You don't need that much space. It's not big steps you're taking. They're just little steps. Maybe about four to six inches for each step forward. Just go a few paces forward and a few paces back. Keep those knees low to the ground. And try to keep those shoulders centered up in between the hands. Come on. 10 more seconds. No quit here, come on. Five seconds. Three, two, go ahead and stand up. Grab your dumbbell in the right hand. Step back on your right leg. Curl, press, lock out the elbow. Step forward, bring the dumbbell back down. Repeat, step back, curl, press, step into it, and back. Here we go, press, step up, and back. Remember the modification, complete the entire curl and press there, and then step forward. Switch arms, step back, curl, press, step forward, and return. Here we go, and back, come on. Step back, curl, press, and good. Step back, come on, press, there we go. Let's go, one more time. Good, hold the dumbbell right here in front of your hip. One squat, one squat, jump, one squat, one squat, jump, come on. One squat, squat, jump, let's go. One squat. Squat, jump. One squat, squat, come on. 20 seconds. Let's go. Keep working it. Come on. 10 seconds. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one, done. That's one down. We're doing that three more times. You got 30 seconds. Great job, everybody. 15 seconds. We have our beast plank crawl. Not too tough, right? Nah, nothing to it. Nothing to it. All right, here we go. In three, two, one. Here we go, come on. Back to our crawls. Remember, those knees are close to the ground. And the knees stay pretty much centered right under the hips. The hands, shoulders are right over the hands. Just these little steps. Doesn't have to be big steps. Going further isn't gonna make it easier. Come on, come on. 10 seconds, don't quit here. Let's go. Five, four, three, two. Come on up. Grab that dumbbell, put it in your right hand. Step back on your right leg. Curl, press, step forward, return the dumbbell. Repeat, and back, come on. Step back, curl, press, and step back. Lock that elbow out, step forward into it. Come on, switch arms. Step back, curl, press, forward, come on. Keep it going. That's right, you're breathing. Five seconds, four, three, give me one more. One, and we go, squat. Squat, jump. Squat, and jump. Come on, squat, jump, let's go. Squat, squat, jump. Let's do it. Come on, this is 
is easy. There's nothing to it. Just pushing the ground away. Come on, 15 seconds. Keep working. Push the floor. Land lightly. Land cat like. Four, three, two, one. 30 seconds. Two down, two to go. Whew. That's right, walk it off, walk it off. Ten seconds. Got ten more seconds. Keep working it. Five seconds. Four, three, two. Stand tall. Grab that dumbbell. Right hand. Step back. Hover that back knee. Curl press. Step forward. Repeat. And step forward. Lock out that elbow.
Squat. Squat jump. Let's go. Come on. This is our last one of this circuit. Yeah, that's a break while I go over our next three exercises. So finish this one strong. How high can you jump? Come on, 20 more seconds. Let's work. Good. 10 more seconds. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm. All right, y'all. Woo! Yep. Okay. Our next three. We're going to do a row. However, I have various options for you for the row. So let me go hardest to easiest. I'll be very quick here. I don't want to uh, lose our momentum. So the first one's going to be a single arm row. So you're going to come into our plank row for a uh, renegade row. I can talk today. One arm down, come back. So it's a single arm plank, and the other arm is just pulling that dumbbell to the hip. Right? 20 seconds on one side, 20 seconds on the other. That's the hardest version. Easier version, if you have an elevated surface, a couch, a chair, augment, something like that, then put your hand on that elevated surface, and then you can row from here. It's a little bit easier here. You can still maintain that core integrity, keeping the tailbone tucked under, so on and so forth. 20 seconds on each arm. The easiest way would be to come into a stagger stance and just do your row from a stagger stance. Okay, so you pick which one you want to do, all right? The next one we're going to do a dumbbell around the world or an overhead press. Let me show you this around the world. This is great for the shoulders and excellent for the core. So what you're thinking of doing here, the dumbbell is going to go around the head and back. We're just going to circle the head, bringing the dumbbell from the waist around the head back to the waist. We just do some circles here. Okay, great for shoulder integrity and it's going to work the core. You do 20 seconds one way, 20 seconds on the other way. Try to keep your hip squared up. Don't rotate the hip around. The shoulders will rotate, but the hips try to keep those squared up. Now, if that's too difficult or it doesn't feel right, it could be a little tricky on the lower back, then go into a kneeling position and just do single arm overhead presses instead. And that would be 20 seconds on each arm. And then lastly, we're gonna do four hops and four jump lunges because everybody loves jump lunges. I just, I get so much email about like, we need more jump lunges, so here you go. <laughs> totally kidding, here we go. We're gonna go one, two, three, four, and then jump lunge for four. Three, four, back to your bounces, one, two, three, four, and down for four jump lunges. Those are your next three, same protocol. 40 seconds each one with a 30 second break. All right, no better time than right now to get started. Starting with our Renegade Row. You pick which style you want to use. Three, two, one, let's work. 20 seconds. You've got this version, you've also got a staggered version, and you've also got the single arm plank version. You pick which one works best for you. Keep working it, keep working it. Switch arms. You really feel this work in the core, especially if you're in that plank position. You've got a little less than 10 seconds. Keep going. Woo! Three, two, one. With your dumbbell, let's go around the world. Notice the tempo that I've got going. It's a little speedier than when I demonstrated. You're working your core. And we're also working shoulder integrity. Three, two, one, switch direction. Just around the head, back down toward the hip. Come on. Keep it going. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Set the dumbbell down, and we're gonna hop four times. Two, three, four. Four jump lunges, two, three, back to the hops, one, two, three, and jump lunge, two, three, four, hops, one, two, three, four, jump it out, two, three, back to the hops, two, three, four, come on. 
Come on. Come on. Yeah. 15 seconds. One, two, three, four. Step it back. Step it back. Come on. 10 seconds. One, two, three, four. Drop it down. Drop it down. Drop it down. Come on. Three, two, one. That's your first 30 second break. Woo! Working it today. No joke. <sighs> 15 seconds. Big breaths in the nose, out the mouth. All right, round two. Back to our renegade row. You decide which version you want to do. Here we go. Three, two, one. Come on. Keep the tailbone tucked if you're in that single arm plank. You've also got this version here, the staggered position. If those planks are a little too rough. Come on. Three, two, one. Switch arms, switch it. Work the core. Pull the dumbbell back toward the hip. Yo, come on. Four, three, two, one. All right, you're either doing our around the world or you're here for single arm overhead presses. That's right. Nice job, you guys. Come on, switch direction or switch sides. Good. Come on, less than 10 seconds. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Time. That's another 30 second break. Woo! Well done, everybody. Well done. Oh, I'm lying. I'm sorry. You guys are right. I'm wrong. Ha! Huh? Four hops. <laughs> and four jump lunges. My bad. Fire me immediately. Three, four, and hop it out. One, two, three, four, four hops. Five seconds, come on. Two, one, time. So sorry about that. How dare I skip an exercise? Whew. All right. You got your 30 second break. 20 seconds to go. And we're on round three. We got this. All right, get ready. Here we go. Round three, ready, game, row. Three, two, one, come on. Dig down, find that grit. Throw a little attitude into the mix. Tap a little bit of that anger. Ah, come on. There you go, switch sides. Let's go, 10 seconds. You got this. Come on. Four, three, Two, one. Let's go around the world. Come on. Good. Three, two, switch direction. 15 more seconds. Nothing to it. 10 seconds. Keep your breath, keep breathing. Five, four, three, two, one. Four hops, four jump lunges. I did not forget this time. Four, one, two, three, four. Back to it. Two, three, one. 
two, three, four, and two, three, one, two, come on, three, four, and one, two, three. keep it going, 20 more seconds, come on, 15 seconds, step it back, step it back, come on, 10 seconds, four, three, two, one, 30 second break, one more round, then I got a little abdominal finisher for you, don't want to leave those abs out, uh-uh, no, 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 big breaths guys, big breaths, in about 10 more seconds, and we have our third, fourth and final round, all right, let's get to it, here we go, Final round, Renegade Rose, let's do it. Three, two, one, come on. Pull the elbow up and back. Keep your core dialed in. Tailbone is tucked. Three, two, one, switch sides, come on. Come on. The wider it stands, the easier it is to control your hip. So if your hip is rotating too much, just widen your stance a little bit. Four, three, two, one. All right, around the world or overhead press. I'm gonna do my overhead presses one more time, but you are welcome to do around the world instead. Come on, three, Two, switch sides, switch direction. Come on. That's right. Ten more seconds. Keep working. Five seconds. Three, two, one. We got four hops. Four jump lunges. Two, three, four hops. And jump lunges. Come on, hop it. Jump lunge. You can also step back into reverse lunge. On those jump lunges, just step back, like so. 15 more seconds. Come on. One, two, three. Come on, five seconds. Four, three, two, I'm Woo! Well done, well done. All righty. Grab yourself a sip of water. I'm gonna grab myself some delicious water. And then we're gonna get to our abs. We don't leave those behind. Uh -huh. All right, I got three abdominal exercises. And we're going to work through these three abdominal exercises, two rounds, six sets total. First one is going to be a oblique crunch. So you're going to lie down on your left side. You're going to extend your left arm out in front of you, right hand behind your head. You're going to press up to that left elbow. And at the same time, you're going to draw your knees towards your chest, tap the top knee with the top elbow. So same elbow to knee, reach back out and repeat. So let's start there. Everybody on down. Let's do 15 reps of these guys on each side. Well, you thought I was going to explain all three of them. Now, nah, we're going to go one at a time. All right, 15 on each side. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's do it. One, reach. Two, come on. Three, four, five, six, eight, nine, I need five more. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides. Fifteen. Here we go. Three, two, one. We go. One, two, three. Come on. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep working. Nine, ten. Five more. Five, four, three, two. 
to and time. Now we grab your dumbbell. Similar to what we were doing earlier with our dumbbell relocate, now we're gonna go into plank position. The dumbbell is gonna live on one side of your body. You're gonna reach under your body. The dumbbell's on the right side. You're gonna reach under with your left arm. Grab the dumbbell, pull it to the left side of your body. Then grab under the right arm and pull it back. We're going 20 total, 10 each way. Here we go. Three, two, one. Pull one side, switch hands, pull the other. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more, come on. One, two, three, four, five. Keep going. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. And we're going to roll over and we're going to do a crucifix crunch. So, you're going to lie back, shoulders off the ground, extend your legs out in front of you, reach your arms out to the side. You're going to pop up to your butt, tap your heels, reach back out. It's as simple as that. We're going to go 20 times. On my count, here we go. Three, two, one. We go one and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's ten. Keep going. One. Come on. Two, three. Good. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Woo! Oh, oh, that was burning. So bad. All right, let's go back over to your left side. Let's get back to those crunches. We're going two times on each of these. So let's get right to it. Lie down on your left side, left arm extended, right hand behind your head. Let's tap that top knee with the top elbow 15 times. Three, two, one, go. One, reach. Two, three, come on. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I need five more, come on, five, four, three, two, and one. Ah, flip it over, here we go. Three, two, one, come on, one, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I need five more, five, four, Three, two, and one. Grab your dumbbell. Grab that dumbbell. Let's get into a plank with our dumbbell switch 20 times. Here we go. Three, two, one. We go. One. Switch arms. Two. Make sure you grab them with the opposite arm. Three. Drag across the body. Four. Five. Come on. Six. Keep going. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. I need ten more. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Roll over to your back. All right. This is it. We're going to take it home. We'll be doing a little cool down stretch if you want to hang out after these. Uh, if not, it's been a pleasure working out with you today. All right, let's get these done. Here we go. Three, two, one. Pull the knees in, tap the heels. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Give me ten more. Ten, nine, eight. Come on. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Done.